everyone my name is jitendra bafna i am a senior solution architect in this video we are going to see how to enable tls on the flex gateway running as a kubernetes ingress controller in previous video we have seen how to expose a multiple apis to the flex gateway running as a kubernetes ingress controller in this video i will going to showcase you how you can easily enable a tls or https on your APIs published to the Flex Gateway running as a Kubernetes Ingress Controller. So let me first go to the MuleSwap documentation. Here MuleSwap provide a good documentation for configuring a TLS on your Flex Gateway running as a Kubernetes Ingress Controller. So basically like it contain um, like all the information you can go through that. The important things like you know you need to copy this content and you have to provide a private key in the base 64 string. You have to provide a public certificate in the base 64 string. And these are the some ciphers supported and you can just mention min version max version and this like you can keep all this information as it is right and let me go to my ingress tls file so here this is how my ingress tls file looks like and like this is my private key in base 64 string you can simply generate a private key and just extract the base 64 string out of this and then from private key you can extract the public key and just generate the base 64 string out of it no? so here this is my public certificate so pri this public certificate should be matched to this particular private key right so you cannot have a like a different private key and different public certificate they should be they should be like from the same uh, key or like you have to extract this public certi certificate from this above private key basically right yeah so this is a simple file and let me apply this file for applying this tls file I have already saved this TLS file in the YAML format on my desktop. Let me copy this path. Okay, and just uh, I will just say CMD. Okay, let me use I want to use the CD command. Okay, I have done that. Now I will use a simple command. I will say kubectl. Then I will say apply. And I want to apply whatever file name you have saved it. I have saved as ingress-tls.yml. It can be uh, yaml also. That's fine. Then in which name space you have to apply? Gateway. So I have already applied. It's saying unchanged. But in your case, like you know, it will say configured or created. So I have done that. Now I will quickly go to all all my APIs and I will just update the protocol on my APIs. I will just say view details. And this is my API which I have you know published in my previous video on HTTP. And I will just change to HTTPS, save and apply. Just go back. I will go one by one. I will change the protocol for every API. Just make sure port 8081. Then finally, health I've done. I think employee is done. It's order. No, for it's sorry. So for order, it's only 8082 only. For employee, it's 8081. Go back. Okay, I have changed all the ports, uh, or oh, sorry, not port, all the protocols for all the APIs. Let me make sure my Flex Gateway is running. During the changes, there might be possibility your Flex Gateway will try to restart. Maybe not. Depend. Let me go to Flex Gateway. It's in disconnected state. What you can do, either you can wait or I will simply execute. I have one command which will quickly make sure my Flex Gateway comes up. Okay, I have to go to my this particular location. Okay, it should be up quickly. Okay, this is command prompt. I will execute this command mini cube service ingress 
माइनस एन गेट वे सो हियर यू गेट ऑल द टर्नल यू आर एल सो फॉर एटी एटी वन आई कैन यूज द फर्स्ट यू आर एल कॉपी दिस ट्राई टू एग्जीक्यूट से ए पी आई स्लैस एम्प्लॉयज इट विल गिव मी एरर सो इट इट शुड बी एस टी टी पी एस ए पी आई स्लैस एम्प्लॉयज लेट मी चेक विद माई फ्लेक्स गिट विच डाउन अगेन इट शुड नॉट बी it's up and running so 1 2 3 i'm using 32 only right so just let me check whether like uh, whatever api i publish so let me check my employee api i'll go to view details run configuration it is 881 only let me do one thing let me generate a tunnel url again so 881 so i can say 123 let me copy this let me wish i stop the tunnel i can open other browser Just I will say https slash api slash employees. Maybe flex gateway is down again. Possibility. Yes. So let me make sure. Like it try to restart. Like you know, it takes some time to get the stability. Just a minute. Let me close. Let me say CMD. Okay, and I think let me generate a tunnel URLs again. Copy this. Just say HTTPS slash API slash employees. Yeah, we got the prompt for username and password. So this will give me an employee response. Let me take the set third, fourth URL. This is for orders. So now I got a response on HTTPS. HTTPS slash API slash orders. I got an orders response. Let me take my third API, which is health. Copy this. Just paste it. Say HTTPS slash health. so i got the response from all the three api so generally like initially like when you are setting up a flex gateway you can notice there will be some restart happens like it will keep on creating new replica so don't worry about that okay so i hope you understand like how to enable a tls or https on your flex gateway uh running as a kubernetes ingress controller i hope you like the video if you like the video please click on like and subscribe button thanks for watching